All right, I wanna talk about squatters. How do you prevent a squatter from being on your property? Well, there's several different types of squatters. One is a squatter who comes onto your property without notice, the property's vacant, and they decide that they're gonna live in this property without your permission. So that's the squatter that most people think about. But the one most people don't think about is tenants that hold over. So what do I mean by a holdover tenant? I mean a tenant that was renting this house, and this is a, a real life case, was renting this house and they decide to stop paying the rent. Well, they are officially becoming a squatter, especially if the, if the homeowner or the property management company asks them to be removed from this house and they decide to stay without permission, they then become a squatter. So if you're a landlord and you're trying to prevent squatters from coming on your property, number one is do everything you can not to let the property go vacant. And if, it's, if it is vacant, you need to keep a very close eye on it. You need to drive by daily to make sure somebody doesn't kick the door in and starts living in your house without permission. Now, if you have a renter and they turn out to be a bad renter, you wanna make sure you get them out as quickly as possible. The last thing you wanna do is have a holdover tenant who's living there without your permission, not paying, and you don't go through the proper procedures to get them out, and they turn into a tenant that turns into a squatter. So protect yourself. If you're a landlord, know the law, know how to get the tenants out that are bad, know how to background check tenants and make sure that they're good tenants. And definitely, definitely, if you do not have a lease agreement, make sure you always have a lease agreement that has protections in there to the fullest extent of the law. And if you're not wanting to deal with any of this garbage, then you need to hire a professional property manager and they'll take care of all of, all of that headache. They'll take it all off of your plate. So in this case here, we had a tenant, the owner's out of the country. We manage his property. She got laid on the rent. We need to get the tenant out as quickly as possible background a new tenant, make sure that they're qualified and have them move into the house. And make sure you just never know when things are gonna go wrong. So you always gotta make sure that you have those protections in place or you have the right team, like a property manager and an attorney that can walk you through the process and make sure that uh, you don't end up with a squatter on your property. And of course, make sure that your property remains profitable. That's the most important thing in real estate investing. Have a clean, safe place to live and that it's profitable because a lot of people have a lot of money tied up in their rental properties. So you want to make sure that you're protecting it to the fullest extent you can.